Hey everyone, today I'm diving deep into the world of electric vehicles to analyze whether NIO, one of China's leading EV manufacturers, is a stock worth buying in 2024. Just a couple of years back, NIO was the toast of Wall Street, touted as a major challenger to Tesla um, in the EV space. But fast forward to today and the picture looks a lot less rosy. In 2024, NIO's stock is down almost 51% and it's been a rough ride with no signs of slowing down. Despite these challenges, some analysts are still backing NIO. They argue the company's strategic initiatives like launching new budget-friendly models and securing hefty investments could signal a turnaround. But let's be honest, the EV market is brutal and NIO is wrestling with Wesian for its NIO, um, well, is intense competition and external economic pressures. So uh, what's really going on here? On one hand, NIO's got a solid balance sheet which could help them weather the storm in the EV industry slump. They trade at an attractive valuation with a next 12 months enterprise value to sales multiple of just 0.89 kex. That's pretty low, suggesting the stock might be undervalued, but there's a catch. For NIO to really succeed and, and see their stock price rise above $10, a lot needs to go right, not just within the company, but in the broader economic environment too. Um, then there's the bearish side of the argument. Some experts are advising investors to, to steer clear of NIO pointing to its tiny market share in the Chinese EV market and its struggles to break into international markets. Plus, their operating losses are staggering and without a clear path to profitability is a risky bet. Um, in conclusion, um, investing in NIO in 2024 is not for the faint of heart. It's a high risk, high reward scenario. If you're considering it, make sure it aligns with your risk tolerance and investment strategy always do your homework and maybe just maybe neo could be a part of your portfolio but remember hope is not a strategy thanks for tuning in and make sure to do your own research before making any investment decisions catch you in the next one